everyone, I am Randy Suarez, aka Silver Coach, today back here with another amazing reaction. Then we're back with some more beef between Abba and Abba and Preach and Fashion Fit because uh, some auto leaks had been leaked out. And uh, the title of the video is Auto Leaks Fresh and Fit Wish They Were White. And by God, that is insane. I mean, how insecure of, you, of yourself you have to be to wish that you were another ethnicity. I don't mean to be rhyming, it just sometimes comes off like that. But, um, yeah, but I'm always confused when people actually have that thought, like, oh, I wish I was blah, so, 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 and so. I'm like, no, you don't. Like, especially when it's a lot, oh, I wish I was a different, different ethnicity or something like that. And I'm like, I'm two. I'm literally half black and half Hispanic. I accept both sides because I am me. But some people don't see it that way, sadly. So, but you're not here to he hear my thoughts about that weird subject. You have to hear to watch me to react to their thoughts about this whole entire thing and their beef <laughs> with Fresh and Fit. So if you like any any of this content, please like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Like, comment, and subscribe to Alba and Preach. I will leave the original link to this video down below so you can watch it uninterrupted. Also, link to my Twitter, Instagram, and TikTok. Follow me on those social platforms. Link to my cash up. Feel gracious enough to donate wherever you want to donate. That's fine. If you don't, that's fine as well. Say thanks with stupid things. But by donating, liking, commenting, subscribing, sharing, it lets me know you rock with the reaction content. Rock with the channel and rock with your boy. But further ado, buckle up, man. Let's get started. All right, we're here with some more Abba and Preach. And it seems like these auto leaks about to get a little bit more juicy. So let's go. Being worshiping white people, from putting on Myron's being worshiping white people, from putting on the hood to working with dudes who basically want him erased. This is a, one of those Twitter spaces he was in. Yeah. So look at the, what it's called. Lit comfy hours, whites only. Crazy. But now wow. we get audio from some of the things that these people think about him. And all the censored words, it's their favorites. You even asked this, he's like, if any, if, you know, if I kind of break the rules, just hit me up about it, guys, you know? Because, and I agree with him, like, we gain nothing. Like, one of the, and they talk nice, they're like, oh, look, white people deserve their space, and can't we just be friends, and blah, blah, blah. But then later that night, they're just behavior. You know, I think it was you, Comfy, that was speaking about that guy where he, a half an hour later, he posted and shit, like, yeah. She says you can and just pull. Yeah. Oh, my red, my red jeans. Yeah. Myron Gaines. The what? I don't, I don't, I don't. And Myron wants to be friends with these people. These assholes. These racist piece of garbage. And you want to be friends with them who basically disrespect everything you said that you represent. But you don't really represent that. Who ass are you kissing, Myron? Apparently theirs. Go go back to the top. I think that shit was out of focus. No, 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 no. Cause now you got the the what he said was crazy. Full on behavior. PR. Yeah, but but Myron likes that. He be put on the hood and he 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 be he be tugging it to white men. I was saying it is crazy. Right. What he's saying? Crazier. Like, if that's, you that's, think about it, if you are an actual conservative, the things that the red pill people espouse is completely not in line with how you want the, your society to be. Uh, the thing he said was, don't marry a girl until you're 35. What do you think? Yeah, what a stupidest thing ever, mate. This is why we're talking, this is what, this is what we were saying yesterday. Like, yeah. at the end of the day, they're fucking low IQ, they're low in yeah. control. Even if you know yeah. they say a few things that are based or whatever by our standards, don't wow. fucking fall for it. Don't think that they're on our side. Oh, based. You know, it's just, yeah. it's just you know what I mean, though? This yeah. is I think it's the only reason why some people listen to him. It's because he's a little bit known, but he's still. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. And come the end of the day, come the end of the day, especially in somewhere like the States where they're just everywhere. Um, what you think these people are going to align, you think they're going to help you, they'll turn on you as quick as anything. As fast as a. Right. Yeah. 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 You can tell these guys relish mm. and call them black folks in. For real. And here's the weird part. Knowing that this leaked, they're screwed. Because they're gonna be shining at See, I get good good uh any uh publicity no such thing as a good or bad publicity. No 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 no. To a certain extent, yes, to but to a other extent no, because at the end of the day, if it paints you into an like, extreme bad light of you saying this 
Oh, you're beyond cooked. Like, seriously. Like, people like that do not understand that when it comes to, like, race in general and in this, uh, ethnicities and all this other stuff, here and a lot of other places, it's a melting pot of different cultures who weren't really born here, but, and, you know, integrating here and becoming one with the place they at. Doesn't matter if it's dating, uh, relationship, marriage. Like, bro, saying all that, it, it, sh it spits on that. It's okay to have a different idea, but if your idea is causing harm, because it could be words, but if it's causing harm, like, bro, you need to look into yourself to see what the hell's going wrong with you. Like, they like it. And, and it's not just the end. You can tell their views behind it. And you can hear mm. low IQ, yeah. Yeah. all this other stuff. Like, mm. they really see them as inferior. Uh -huh. And it's so funny because you see cats like Myron constantly cape for white people. Mm. They'll talk badly about black women. Black men are undateable, not worth dating. Black women are the lowest on the totem pole. You see most of his childhood friends, everyone he's ever grown up with is just white. He loves cape for white folks. But you recognize that the very power structure he's trying to appeal to, that mother. Him. Yeah, mm -hmm. they look at him like, yo, yeah, bro, no matter sorry. how much of an uncle ruckus you are, you still dirt beneath my feet. And, and look, you'll hear Myron, he'll get online, he'll talk about rappers. I know I hate them, entertainers, stupid, black women, doesn't matter what they're doing. But will he speak out against these people? No, no. he's not. He's not. He he'll can't. keep quiet for his white daddies. He'll put on the hood like he's told to. For his white daddies. Bro, keep it a stick. Myron, <laughs> wish he was white. white. I'm still alive. Okay, yeah, so I don't want guys. Yeah, I don't want, I don't want to. Like... Some guys are different about it. Like uh, some dudes are like, "Yeah, this is gonna be funny." Esco Brothers is for a funny yeah, story yeah, and yeah. shit. Um, but I, you know, and then some guys are like, "Hell, fucking no!" I've noticed with black dudes, they don't like doing that shit. White guys, we're all like, "Yeah, we're." Uh, I said we. Yeah, we're not <laughs> me. Yeah, he's, so funny. he's white. He's white. Dude. Uh, See, he's white. Hey. Yeah. You know what they call that? Mm -hmm. A Freudian slip. Mm -hmm. So when you make what is appears to be a mistake on the outside, it's actually just a reflection of what you really think. Mm -hmm. God damn. <laughs> he said we. We. That's crazy. As in we, we. I have we. never spoken about another race of people and said we. I ain't never been like, man, the way Asians move, like, yo, we move different. That's a weird thing to say. Have you ever done that? When have you ever spoken about women and said we? Like, that's crazy. Hey, bro. Hey, hey, man. That was natural. That was natural. <laughs> I officially just stamped Myron as white. Yeah. Oh. What I meant to say, what I meant to say was, when I was in college, <laughs> yeah, I knew that was coming. Mm -hmm. And if you're wondering why he's talking about his college days and all that whiteness stuff, that's what he was hugging him. That's him in college. Mm -hmm. Read the caption out loud. The boys plus are talking. Charlie. <laughs> All right, he needs help. God, please, for real. <laughs> oh my God! Like, bro, I, I'm like, I'm ready to end them. Like, they want to go here and say, "You're oh. cool, cool." Arab guy that literally, like, I hit so many different check marks for the fucking Arab guy. Did this man just call himself Arab? And I also think I'll do a lengthier project on this, but the red pill in general is very, very keen on constantly catering to whiteness in general and degrading blackness. And you mm -hmm. notice there's a trend that goes through all the red pill. Yeah. Most of the creators I've seen spend a tremendous amount of time speaking poorly about black people and raising white people. What's crazy is that they'll bring people like Nick Fuentes. They don't care if it's mm -hmm. Richard Spencer. Dudes who literally proclaim and we need to have a majority of white people and white people need to be running America. Only white people should be running the country. On average, blacks have the lowest IQ. Yeah, I, right. I feel like I remember there being a leaked phone call and some other stuff that came out too that got you kicked out of school too, no? Was that? Yeah, yeah, that is something. Something about happened. like, if a white girl dates a black person, it's the same as like dog, something like that maybe? I I... As a person who is, who's with a person who is white complected, or, yes, my fiance is white, You're an asshole, sir. It's not because you have a different view of, of than the most of the world. No, 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 no. You cannot recognize the hatred that you speak. 
that's more disturbing to me. Yes, a lot of people say, oh, freedom of speech. Yes, you have the freedom to speak, but you don't have the freedom of the consequences of that speak. All this negativity for what, man? For what? You know, not with the Jim Crow stuff. Who cares? Oh, they had to drink out of a different water fountain. Big deal. Oh no, they had to go to a different school. Uh, you know, even if it was bad, who cares? That they don't want minorities of black folks in their country. They don't want interracial. They don't want you to hold office or power. They, they bring these people on and then they suck them off. They suck out that white cement like it might bleach their skin. It's crazy. For that real. to me is the part that I'm like, I can't rock with you. Mm -hmm. You are so brainwashed and so mm -hmm. stupid that you're literally going to come here and champion a man who wants you. You're going to look him in the eyes and smile while the dude is literally holding the blade he wants to press to your neck. Mm -hmm. And then you want to tell me you're not mentally ill. Mm -hmm. and, he's, and he's not like it's uh, sheep. He's not hiding it. He's letting no, you know what he wants to up. do. Up. He's telling you you don't belong. He, I had to watch Sneeko over here defend Nick Fuentes when he said he's against interracial marriage, which is the very thing that birthed Sneeko in the first place. That's... Sneeko wouldn't even exist if Nick Fuentes was in power. Oh, let's, no. let's be honest, Mr. Fuentes. You came on here and you said yourself that you are not for interracial marriage and that prescriptively you feel like it shouldn't be a thing within the society because you think it's bad for it. Like, Nick really, if he, I listened to this whole call, I don't think he said anything that makes you want to cancel him. I think he's a good guy. He's saying, hey, I love everybody. Is he really being that Yo, that's crazy that you're saying Smith, that. Though, that's Sneeko, so, 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 I'm not even going to lie. If he had his way and he had, first off, you wouldn't even exist because you're the basis of an interracial marriage. So, But you don't mm -hmm. find it kind of crazy that the idea word that he envisions is one in which you wouldn't exist in? Yep. These people are lost. Very they are lost. not mentally well. While they're speaking on transgenderism and people changing, they literally want to champion people that would erase them. Mm -hmm. Forget erasing your gender. These people champion people that would erase their whole existence. Yep. Mm -hmm. Think about that. Think about this. Over I to my that being said, videos. what did I say that's a lie? Yeah. Like, bro, I, I'm, like, I'm ready to end them. Like, they want to go here and say, you're a cool. Cool. The Arab guy that literally, like, I hit so many different check marks. Oh, no, no, so we take turns. No, 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 Nick. Oh. No, 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 no. Can I, can I, the... I can't. What the? I heard that some of y'all were raising the salute, so I decided to come back. Oh, Let's go. Uh, <laughs> Poor Sneeko. Uh, I forgot all, all about that. this. Oh, come on. No! We're down. No, no, Dad's yeah. down. No, no, no. Let's no. go. We're down for what happened. Yep. Let's. <laughs> do, you, do you realize how dumb everyone has to be that when you're in a room full of people that somehow just pearly things seems to be the smartest person you see her sliding mm -hmm. off screen like what the fuck am i associating myself with i don't mm -hmm. think there's anything wrong with a black person saying they're concerned i think there's plenty of people who do it ethically while still denouncing yep. race these people are not it something's wrong and i'll get to the uh, like I said, i'll do a lengthy project on the whole race portion of the red pill that i think is insane but um Maybe you guys disagree. Maybe mm -hmm. you guys feel differently. I would love to hear from you guys. But I think it's very hard for you to sit here and try to tell me that the red pill is not intertwined with worshiping whiteness. Mm -hmm. When almost every creator that you can imagine from the red pill community, I can point to you videos of them worshiping whiteness endlessly. Now that mm -hmm. we've brought it all together. I thought this would be a good opportunity to bridge this from this conversation to what? a topic of self-loathing and how I feel like Myron... Whatever he is, he's, I think he's just an archetype, representative of one. Of a lot of people who have a lot of internalized hatred towards their own group mm -hmm. and don't recognize that the reason why they constantly speak ill of their own group and then just appeal to whiteness or to black. Like, you might even hear white folks who do this cringe shit. And, it, it, like, you watch it right now who don't yeah. see anything wrong with this, you would 1,000% think it's cringe if a white person came out and constantly was whining, like, oh, my God, white people are so evil. White people are just the worst. Like, we've laughed at people like that. Because it's just like, bro, you're trying too hard. When they just suck. Yeah... Yeah, I, I I have laughed at that because at the end of the day, like, bro, we get it. You, I understand. White people did a lot of bad things, yeah, but they're not their ancestors. It's just the people who are trying to be their ancestors are the assholes, not people who just there just to be there and just chilling. Like minorities and constantly talk shit about whiteness. This is the exact same thing, but from mm -hmm. the other end of the spectrum. Yeah, exact same thing. Maybe the roots of it are a little bit different, but it's the same kind of behavior. You get what I'm trying to say? Mm -hmm. And 
I've known enough people like this mm -hmm. where no matter how the conversations progress, eventually comments will come out that are just negative about their own culture, negative about their own people. And it's never balanced out with very positive reinforcements, never balanced out with, oh, these some things, these people. No, it's always negative. Yeah. And then it's always praising another group. Why can't you mm -hmm. be like them? Why can't you be like them? So I don't know whenever I've grown up with these times, they've always made me uncomfortable mainly because it's just like if you don't like yourself and what you're about that's going to show up in other areas of your life mm -hmm. i think it's very difficult to be a happy person and to hate your race to hate your own skin color whether it's internalized you don't realize it or it's external how so just being around people like that has always made me uneasy but that's you? super weird there yeah. that's super weird but yeah that happens there's a lot of people that it happens like that people are willing to date <clears throat> they date people that they hate i've seen that a lot Mm -hmm. They pay people that they hate or they hate their own selves. It happens. I knew there was something off. What gave it away? Was it the wearing the clan hat? Yeah, that. Yeah, that yeah. I mean, that was crazy. That was was crazy. You know the one that made me think this dude was definitely not black? Mon monkey noises is crazy. No, the one that killed me was watching him dance. My man was doing the hokey pokey to a hip hop track. Yes. Yes. Yeah. Booty queen! Booty queen! Booty queen! But clowns you for dancing. Cool. Mm -hmm. Hey, listen, you can clown me for dancing for as many as. Listen, dancing, listen if awesome. Myron says you gay, that's how you know you straight. For real. <laughs> Whatever Myron says, the opposite is probably mm -hmm. true. That's why it never bothered me when these niggas said I was gay, because I'm like, I know what y'all be doing behind closed doors. For real. I know who you be laying up in bed with, mm -hmm. and I know what color like to suck on and it's okay hmm? it's okay what did i say it's okay okay it's, it's okay that they like that i agree my whole thing is i don't like it when i go into a home and all the doors are closed open the closet come on out mm -hmm. <laughs> that's all i'm saying <clears throat> yeah, but, uh, there ain't no problem with that it's fine it's, it's cool that you you, you you like what you like it's, yeah. it's totally it cool okay yeah, what does he like describe it to me Describe it to me. No. No. Come on, <laughs> no. What, what, what it look like? No. Where'd it go? I don't. I, I would. What that mouth do? What that mouth? Fire on this. <laughs> but if, if that's what you like, though, yeah. it's fine. Yeah. But it's a bit wild when you point out the fingers to other people. Yeah. If if if, if, if that's what you like, it's cool. Then it's cool. I, I don't think these dudes are actually, you know, encloseted. Uh, you know, I think it's a funny joke considering how sus they are all the time. Mm -hmm. But I 1,000%... One, that being said, I 1,000% think that Myron sometimes doesn't like black people. I can't. If I do the accent for too long, I literally start becoming slower. <laughs> um, what do you think when you met people like this? Met people like what? That, that, uh, that you know, the self-hatred stuff. Oh, I stay away from them. Mm -hmm. Sure, sure, it's sure. But what have you observed about them? What do you? What would you? What would you tell them? They're not happy. No, they're Are far they from not? happy. Well, do, yes, do, they, they're not. Yeah, of, well, of course, because they don't want to look like. They know that the the word self hatred is not good, mm -hmm. right? So they're not gonna admit that they are. So just like white people, when you tell them, you know, that's they know it's bad to be, so they don't want to be that. They don't want to admit that. Or even black people, they don't want to admit that it's racist. No, no, we, we can't be, we can't. So they just deny it. Yeah, mm -hmm. like we should get rid of white people. That's not racist, I can't be racist. No, I'm like, I can't be racist. I'm not racist. Okay, like, boss. yo, okay, cool. Yeah. That's crazy, what you just said is crazy. Mm -hmm. Getting rid of, getting rid of people is crazy. Saying that is crazy in a, right. in a vacuum or not. It's just crazy. Yeah. Anyways. Yeah, there's denial, definitely denial there. Everybody thinks what they're doing is righteous. Everybody is the hero in their story. Sure. So, whenever they go about it, like, they got reasons. And because they got reasons, they have the right to do that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Your emotions are valid. Yeah, sometimes your emotions is garbage. For real. That's pretty much it for today's video. I just wanted to kind of bring this up to you. What do you guys think about this archetype? Are you guys surprised to hear the stuff you heard? Do you guys agree or disagree with our assessment? I'm going to be honest with you. If I'm ever supporting the cause and the motherfuckers from that cause are talking about me that way. I'm not supporting the cause. I'm going to be doing some soul searching. Yeah, yeah, yeah. For real. Man. What am I supporting that these people want to get rid of me? I, to me, I can't get over that fact. Yo, that's crazy. Right. You are literally sucking off the dudes who, who want to get rid of Yeah. Crazy. For real.
And the one thing is, when it comes to self hatred and everything, it's like it's definitely is insecurities. They can say it ain't, but it is like what Meyer needs to do is cut the bullshit, seek some help, do some soul searching, and quit the bullshit. I say that twice for a reason because uh, some people need to hear more than just once. But what are y'all thoughts? Let me know in the comments down below. So, uh, but that being said, that's the end of the video. So, if you like any other content, please like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Like, comment, and subscribe to Abba and Preach. I will leave the original link to this video down below so you can watch it uninterrupted. I'll leave a link to my Twitter, Instagram, TikTok. Follow me on those social platforms. And uh, to next time, please take care of yourself. So, hydrate, stay safe, stay warm. Peace out. Little questions is everything they know about you.